Germany is known as the country of poets and thinkers and there's a reason for that. We've managed to come up to invent certain things that have changed the world and how it is today. So here are five things, five inventions from Germany that have changed the world. Number one, modern prints and the way we are printing books, magazines and more. Der Buchdruck. Invented by Johannes Gutenberg in 1440, long time ago. Yes, it's true, because back in the day, in 1440, the good guy Johannes Gutenberg pretty much laid down all the foundations for books and other printed mass media we know today. While we don't know too much about his persona or his vita, the way he lived basically, we know that he was somewhat religious and that he printed his own Bible, the so-called Gutenberg Bible. That book and the method of printing stuff like that efficiently and practically had a huge impact on the world and without that stuff we might not have or know books the way we know them today. Number two, the light bulb. Die Glühbirne invented by Heinrich Goebel in 1854. Up until a few decades ago, people were still dependent on candlelight or daylight. It's hard to imagine today. However, then a pal called Heinrich Goebel came into the spotlight and he worked on artificial light over 20 years of his life, I believe. And then he came up with the first light bulb, die Glühbirne. And although the light bulb might be dead by today, I still wanted to mention it because it was a very important thing in many people's lives for almost two centuries, I guess. The 19th and the 20th century. And of course, Die Glühbirne laid down many more foundations for many more artificial light bulb thingies and lamps. Yeah. Number three, the telephone. Das Telefon invented by Philip Reis in 1859. There are quite a few interesting facts about this invention. First of all, Philip Reis worked as a teacher and then he came up with the idea of transferring, transmitting sound from one place to another. And it actually worked. So put into other words, he basically invented the telephone. But unfortunately, he encountered bad luck at the end of his life. He didn't have a patent for it and he died in 1874, just one year before the American Graham Bell came up with a patent for the telephone. Yeah. Number four, the dynamo, der Dynamo, invented by Werner von Siemens in 1866. Staying in the field of electricity, this one might be one of the most important inventions for our daily lives ever. Today, many different kinds of dynamos are frequently used for many different power supplies or like public power stations, nuclear power stations and so on. And just on a side note, it's true, Werner von Siemens co-founded Siemens, the company, in 1847. And it's still existing today. And last but not least, number five, another very complex, beautiful and really useful device. Beer. Das Bier. Yeah, technically it's not true that we Germans invented the first beer ever because there were many other cultures before us that knew about beer and that brewed their own kinds of beer. However, we were the first ones to have an official list of limited ingredients for beer brewing, so to speak. It was in 1516, a long time ago again, that Wilhelm der Vierte von Bayern, also known as Wilhelm IV, Duke of Bavaria, came up with the first limited list of allowed ingredients for beer, for proper beer, that is. Das Reinheitsgebot the first proper official food declaration in the whole world that is still existing today. Incredible. Yeah, as incredible as German beer. 
Well done, sir. Duke. Wilhelm! Wilhelm, Wilhelm. Yeah, those were five inventions from Germany that changed the world. Well, not the world, but the whole universe. Especially the German beer. The German beer declaration. However, there are many more famous inventions from Germany, so I might do more videos about those as well. Yeah. In case you enjoyed this video, leave a like, subscribe to the channel for staying up to date for more videos about the German language and culture and well, check out very interesting links in the video description down below, for instance links to my social media pages and support options for the channel such as PayPal or Patreon. So thanks for watching anyway, I'm your Vlog Dave. tschüss und bis zum nächsten Mal. Only drink German beer.